Welcome back. I'm Andrew, former high school teacher and founder of Classkick. I'm here to share with you more features today, starting with automated feedback for students. You know Classkick lets you see all your students working in real time, but what if you want to get automated feedback for your students? Well, you can add as many fill in the blanks and multiple choices as you want. So watch as I add this fill in the blank here, and I'm going to add an acceptable answer, like three centimeters. I can add many other acceptable answers too if I want, as well as change it to a STEM keyboard answer. I'm going to make this one worth a few points, and now I'm ready to see what my students get on this view. Oh look, these students are all getting it right. This student needs some help here. Also, a bonus feature for today, as you can see, Serena actually got this correct but it's marking it wrong, so I'm going to click to add to list of acceptable answers. And now it shows Serena got it right, and everyone else gets credit too, because that answer is now on the list of acceptable answers automatically, saving me a lot of time. Also, if I don't want my kids to get automated feedback right away, maybe I want to turn on that feedback at the end of the assignment, I can always toggle it off and toggle it back on. Also, here's an example of a multiple choice automated feedback. Now one more bonus feature is that you can shrink down to this spreadsheet view and see data more clearly. So if I want to sort this by grades low to high, I can see at the top here, okay, John might need some extra help. I'm going to pull him aside in a small group. Also, I have all this great data now and I may just want to put this right into the gradebook so students get this feedback in their gradebook as well and now we have export grades. That is a bonus feature I'm going to make a separate video about. Thank you so much. We look forward to seeing you next time.